I like to take pens apart. Not all pens are interesting to take apart, of course, but some pens are. This is a Clip Click brand pen. It's interesting because not only does it have the spring action that all uh, click clicking pens have, but it uses a different mechanism for blocking it from popping up than it does for blocking it from popping down. So if I can block off the mechanism that prevents it from popping up too far, then the internals of the pen will simply leave the pen entirely. Well, it's easy enough to take this pen apart like most pens. And like all click action pens, it has a spring that keeps the ink cartridge itself popped up when it's supposed to be. So right now it's popped up. When it's popped down, the spring is loaded. Pretty simple, really. Now, the spring alone doesn't have quite the force to get it out of the pen entirely. However, you can always add more springs. So, here's two more springs from the same brand of pen. going to add them to the end of this spring by simply twisting them together a little bit, like so. So here is three pens, all or three springs, all as one. Then I will attach them to the end of the ink cartridge, put it all back together again. And of course with this many springs, takes a fair amount of force to attach the top and a fair amount of force to click it in. And there's a fair amount of force pushing it back out again. What that means is that this is of course a much more powerful projectile, as I will demonstrate. 